Hi everyone, it's Denise from Paper Pastime. Today I'm going to show you how to make this cute little favor box. It's just a pillow box. Um, I'm just going to show you how I did the glitter. Some of you probably already know how to do this, but it worked really well. These are the favors, favors, the favors, the favors for the National Honor Society Winter Formal that my daughter volunteered to be in charge of. So I got them all cut out this morning. I don't have them all together. I've got them scored. So we got to do 70 of these, but they're quick and easy. The longest part, I'm sure, was the cutting them out. So I'm just going to show you how I did that. Um, this was an SVG file. Ooh, blurry. Back off a little bit so maybe you can see that better. Okay. Um, I could cut two per page on 8.5 by 11, or I could get four out of a 12 by 12 sheet. So what you're going to do, all you're going to need to do this is your cut file. The magic ingredient here is just this clear packing tape. The only thing I don't like about this tape is trying to find the end. <laughs> you're supposed to fold it over. But that's the rule, but nobody ever does it. So you're going to use that and then just some glitter. All you have to do is get a piece of tape big enough to cover your cutout, which is what I'm doing off camera here. If you're on the inside, you're just going to put your tape sticky side down over your opening, like that. Get your glitter. There's not a neat way to do glitter, I found, but this is pretty good. I like to keep it in a big, shallow container. Put it sticky side down, press on it, and then just flip it over. You have to, I need a brush to dust that off, but I'll just do it with my finger for now, and there you have it. I just I think it's a great way to do glitter. It gives you a pretty even coverage and no glue, no Xyron. Okay, then just to put the box together, I'll show you that really quickly. You just have to put it adhesive, adhesive on this one strip. I have a new roll of tape in my gun and it's working really well. I hope it continues. Sometimes I have a hard time. Okay, you just gotta line that up. Now I do have a score page for this, so it scored the little curved cuts. So hopefully that's going to work when I try to fold them in. Yeah, that's I did. We haven't decided what we're going to put in them yet. We think just some sort of chocolate. There. And there you go. Okay. 68 more to go. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.